What's happening, YouTube? Dylan here, coming to y'all today, man, just to lend a helping hand to those that may need it. Um, I know it's winter time. Happy New Year's, by the way. It's the 31st, last day of the year, last couple hours. Felt like uh, talking to the people real quick, but um, I know the winter time is a time that I guess people get uh, what's called seasonal depression. You know. Uh, me personally, I'm weird. I actually like the winter time. I like when it's dark and cloudy, you know, like it is today. I like that kind of shit. But uh, you know, I, I got friends. I know I've known people my whole life that for uh reasons, scientific reasons, you know, the sun's not beaming through, giving those, you know, giving that energy to really boost your mood and help you smile more. So it's a tough time right now for a lot of people. And uh, I just want to help you all think about some things and try to put things into perspective and give you guys a different mindset if you're going through that. So, you know, when it comes to depression, man, I personally, again, this is why it's a little weird because I've, I've experienced sadness and brief moments of it. And I might have experienced a little depression, but... When I hear other people describe what their depression is like, I don't think I've technically really fully gone through with that. But at the same time, I can understand it. You know, I can see you getting dug into such a hole that is depression. OK, so what I think some things that will help out, man. Uh, first off, uh, exercise basic exercise if you don't even have to hit the gym and go intense just a basic walk going on a walk outside now i know this you know i'm just i'm gonna have people i'm gonna play half devil's advocate for the people out there that may be just like no Dylan, that don't that don't help me out and that's fine but i really think going on a walk no matter the weather no matter the whatever the conditions are outside Simply going on a walk and uh, getting some fresh air, man. It's going to help you out a lot. All right. That's one thing that'll help. So just exercise, getting your heart moving, getting your blood flowing. Get out the house, you know. Because, man, I know a lot of depressed people tend to be stuck in a room. There's a lot of sleeping going on, a whole lot of sleeping. You got to get up, guys. You got to get up out of bed at some point, make your bed, you know, start there. Basics, make your bed, uh, you know, clean your house that I mean, this is like these are going to sound real basic, but I feel like these help out a lot. I've heard other depressed people that have gone through it talk about this. So I'm just kind of relaying the message. Clean up your house, man. Your house is in a way is reflective of your your life and if your house is just a mess and over time you keep coming home to this mess it's gonna affect your psyche in a way believe it or not i know when i come home after a long day and my house is shitty i got dishes in the sink you know my room i got dirty clothes i didn't put up or you know laundry i didn't put away I hate it. I hate when I have laundry in a basket from, you know, six days ago that I haven't put up yet. It's the worst. It's, it's a procrastinating feeling. And that shit eats away at you a little bit. It's not a big, severe thing, but it does affect you, believe it or not. So I highly recommend, man, if you have a, a messy house, go ahead and clean it. Start cleaning that up. That's going to lift your mood up quite a bit. I can almost guarantee it. That'll help out. Um, <clears throat> okay, so we got getting out the house, cleaning up the house. Um, now, another thing, if it's really severe, I highly recommend you talk to somebody. Definitely talk to a, a friend. You got somebody out there, guys. Somebody out there is uh, is in your corner. Family members, friends. You know, your neighbor, somebody, somebody was willing to help you out and listen. You know what I'm saying? I mean, shit, if you're watching this and you're, you're going through it, talk to me. Message me. 
I ain't doing nothing. I'll, I'll message you right back, man. I'll help you get through this shit because it's crazy out here. You know, we got this social media era and, you know, you get on Instagram and it's, people are all successful and shit and you, you ain't really doing nothing. It's, 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 I get it. I understand. It's, it's easy to get depressed now, especially nowadays. So uh, just talk to somebody. It's like I said, you got somebody out there. If not, worst case scenario, you got me. You know what I'm saying? I, so uh, that's another thing. Now, of course, you can go to a doctor. You can get, you know, a therapist is great. Of course. I mean, that's a given. Talk to a therapist. Um, I'm kind of sketched out about doctors and shit. But if that's like the worst case scenario and you, you really are on some like suicidal shit, God forbid, Go see a doctor, man. Stop playing. All right. There might be some chemical imbalances that just regular everyday person can't detect that they know about. I'm not a doctor. I don't know nothing about that. So that's for them. All right. I'm not no licensed uh, professional. So take that with a grain of salt. I'm just trying to help out. Um, What else? What else can help? Um, Of course, your diet eat good, eat some good, uh, somewhat healthy foods. You know, I can't speak and say, go all vegan and get a bunch of alkaline foods and, uh, you know, non GMO and all that shit organic. That shit's expensive. I understand, but just try to clean up the diet a bit. You know, you want your, treat your body as the temple it is. And you want, you, you want your temple to be a, a a a healthy optimal place for both your thoughts and your 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 body to operate at its peak level. So yeah, definitely consider that. Um, try all those things I just mentioned. You know, start with cleaning up your your house, clean up your apartment, your room, all that. Uh, you know, you want to definitely. Eventually, get out the house, exercise, get some sunshine if you got it. If there's no sunshine, just at least exercise, break a little sweat, get some sweat beads going. Uh, you want to talk to somebody, somebody close to you that can, you know, really that knows you and understands you and can kind of guide you in, the, in a good direction. Um, and last resort, you know, see a psychiatrist, see a doctor. If things are just really out of hand. Um, and, uh, you know, those are the basic things that I think will help you out of this uh, this hole that you're in. Because, uh, you know, it, it's it's not it's not forever, y'all. This shit is not forever, man. This shit is uh, it's a temporary thing. It's all mental. It's all mental, man. Once you control your mind, you control your life. And that's just that's just facts. Trust me, man, there's there's so many testimonies on this shit. I'm sure you can look it up on YouTube. Um, but, you know, I'm just trying to help out. I know there's people out there that, that need the help. And I'm just here to just spread the message, man. But uh, that's it. I hope you guys cheer up, man. Smile today. Look yourself in the mirror. Tell yourself you're beautiful because you are. You're alive. That's a blessing. Um, And yeah. If you like what you uh, what you heard and you saw, man, go ahead and leave a like. Comment down below what you guys thought and what you want me to talk about next. And uh, subscribe if you haven't already, man. Go ahead and hit that button. Got more content on the way. Uh, I'm going to holler at y'all next time, man. Peace.